Hey guys, TM is here, and in this video, we'll see some jailbreak tweaks for iPads running iOS 9.3.3. These tweaks will help you make your iPad a bit more perfect and productive. So, let's quickly dive into it. Full Folders 9 lets you customize your folders, like changing the grid size to utilize the big screens iPad ship with. Nude Keys is a must have. This tweak lets you customize your keyboard's colors which can make it visually quite pleasing. Medusa for iPad brings the same split screen multitasking from the iPad Pros to iPads. Reveal menu adds the same 3D touch features to iPads found in iPhone 6s. Cylinder is another must have tweak. It lets you change your home screen's animations and there are tons to choose from. Harbor lets you mimic your dog to that of macOS. It even has the same genie effect and lets you add more than 5 icons to the dog. No slow animations make your iPad feel a lot faster than it actually is. It does this by changing the animation speed all around iOS. Minimal Hood is a small but useful tweak. It changes the position of the soundbars from middle of the screen to the top so that it doesn't block any content while viewing the screen. Spotlight Peak On, as the name suggests, removes spotlight search from the left page. Mobius coupled with Spotlight Peak On creates unique infinite scrolling effects on the home screen. Swipe Home kills all apps from the app switcher with a simple swipe on the home screen. Last app lets you quickly return to the most recent app with a simple double tap on the status bar. Berry C8 lets you open apps directly from the lock screen. It has a cool Siri-like animation to it. Browser Changer lets you change your default browser like Chrome for example. Safari Be Better hides top and bottom bars from Safari. It even has some more features. CC Colors lets you change the control center to any color according to your preference. Date in Status Bar does exactly what it says. It's a subtle one but can come in handy. iFile is a full-fledged file browser for iOS. It's a must-have for any jailbroken device. Blurry Badges lets you customize your icon badges on the home screen. Waveflow gives beautiful animations to the music app. Better Shutdown is a must-have for any jailbroken device. It lets you reboot and respring your iPad. Eclipse 3 brings system-wide black theme on your iPad. It totally changes the look of iOS and can be a lot less harsh on eyes, especially at nights. El Capitan Loading Indicator brings the same beach ball loading animation on iPad from Macs. Delete Forever lets you permanently delete photos in a single click rather than doing it twice. iCleaner is also a must have. It clears up all the task files and even the leftover files from deleted tweaks. This can also significantly increase your free storage space. Tim lets you decrease the screen brightness even more than Apple allows you to do. This tweak is really good if you use your iPad at nights. Activator allows you to launch apps or utilities on your jailbroken iPad with a simple swipe, tap, or a button press. GIF Viewer allows you to natively run GIFs in the Photos app, which otherwise you can't do it normally. Movie Box lets you watch movies and TV shows.
Anemone is a free theme manager for your jailbroken iPad. You can choose between tons and tons of themes to personalize it. I have coupled Anemone with two tone theme in this video. Tiny Player Light is a small widget like music launcher. It lets you change songs, play and pause music easily. Bida Font 3 is a font manager which lets you change your iPad font all over iOS. Bigify lets you change your iPad icon size on the home screen. Here's an example. CC settings lets you add custom toggles in the control center. Zeppelin is one of the oldest tweaks on iOS. It lets you add your favorite icons in the status bar. Better 5 icon home screen adds up an extra row of icons on your iPad. Spin settings changes the settings icon to a moving gear. You can even change its speed. So this was it for the video. Hope you guys liked it. Please follow us on Twitter and Instagram for video updates. All links are in the description and please do subscribe.